When I wake up, I feel cozy, yeah. Can you hold up? Don't need no coffee yet. Got no makeup. How do you look so fine? Bless up, bless up. How did I make you mine? Stay a minute, another minute. Hold on a second, I love us moment, yeah. Stay a minute, another minute. Hold on a second, I love this moment. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is a multi-part LA Cali vlog. Currently at MCO flying out to LAX, so we stopped by at the club lounge to get some sustenance because I hate being hungry on a plane. It is the worst feeling. First, we ordered some ravioli. It was giving Chef Boyardee vibes, but it wasn't too bad. Then they accidentally gave us some lackluster brownies, but we needed the sugar to be honest, so it's okay. We were still a little hungry, so I ordered a caprese sandwich. By the way, it was super easy to order. You view the QR code with your camera, and then it brings you to the menu. Choose the order quantity, then press add to place order. Once you get confirmation that your order was received, take a screenshot just in case the waitress or waiter will ask for it. They also had food out and available to grab, as you can see, but nothing tickled my fancy. Our flight ended up being delayed, as you can see, the Delta flight second from the bottom. So annoying. But anyway, let's get to the gate. Let's go. Seven hours later. All right, guys. So we just got into LA for Coachella. And how was the flight? The flight was fine. It was good. I slept and we watched Tar. It was the movie with Kate Blanchett and she's like a mu she's a maestro. And um, I really liked it. <laughs> But it was just like, kind of like. Video, you're confused. It's my star! You fucking little. Well, she did to herself, but it was a great movie. I thought it was really good, but I was like really tired. I don't know if we're getting food now, but it's 11:45. Technically, it's three, um, northeast time. But I'm down for some, um double double animal style to get this LA trip going honey okay cuz okay do you know where you're going yeah okay I'm usually the, I am the better driver but yeah okay I'll see you guys later bye alright guys it's almost 1 a.m. but first meal of the day Necessities in and out, guys. Double double animal style. In and out is literally the best fast food burger joint. Fight me on that. It's freaking delectable, and your faves could never. The In and Out hit the spot, right, Tom? Hit the spot. I could have went for another one, but I have to. tomorrow. Tomorrow. That was delicious. Necessary first stop in and out. The next day. It's 8.50 and this is day, our first full day of LA. This is the LA vlog. Where the fuck are we? Oh yeah, this is, yeah. Okay, you did a good job, Tom. But it's a little bit chilly here and my boyfriend said he's never seen it very, um, in all the years that he's been coming here, he hasn't seen it this gloomy, right? That's what you said? Yeah, it's never been like this. Yeah, but um, we were supposed to go hiking today, but we're not going to do that because of the weather. We're going to go tomorrow, but we are going to get some breakfast at a place where my friend took me a couple of times, Lina, um, when I visited her. So I'm excited for Porto's. Yes. Porto's Bakery is a delicious bakery and cafe that has six locations in California. We are in the Burbank location and every day we visited, it was always full of customers. Every location is busy, that is a fact because the food is delicious and fresh. Also, I feel like they undercharge for their food to be honest. Rosa, a Cuban native who immigrated with her husband to the US, was the founder of Porto's. She started selling her pastries and cakes from her home and eventually her first store in 
in 1976 at Echo Park, California, and the rest is history. Are you hungry, Tom? Yeah. I'm ready for my food. And we got, um, I got a Cuban sandwich, because that's what I got last time, and it was really good. And he got a breakfast wrap, and I got a coffee con leche, and he got a cordonito, and we also got two potato balls, because I got that with my friend Lina, and it was really good. And we're gonna get some pastries, too, because we have a sweet tooth, and it's vacation, and we can do whatever we want, okay? What did you get? Uh, breakfast wrap. Yes, and we have our airborne because we need to keep our immune system up, right? Right. And our potato balls. And I got the cubano, and I'm so hungry. I got a uh, cabbage con leche, and he got a cornetito. I might ask for an extra shot or something later. Oh no, my meds. So we went back for seconds, right top? And I wanted a chocolate croissant, and because we're going to Paris next. That's what he said. And so I was like, it's Not fitting. <laughs> and then two, two Dolce de Leche uh, Besitos, courtesy of Lina. And then he got a apple strudel. And then they gave us a free almond strudel. So yay, go us. Well, I'm gonna have my apple strudel. Alright, I'm gonna have my chocolate croissant. Croissant? Because we're going to Paris. Okay, come on. What are we cheersing to? Cheers to... Paris. Uh, <laughs> You're gonna speak... Yeah. Cheers to not Paris. No! Uh, pick a better one. Cheers to moving to Ischia. Okay, cheers to moving to Ischia. Blink, like. itty dink, itty. Mmm. 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 You good? Succulents talk. Succulents. Succulents. Like I suck on No, this is Topanga Canyon. I've never been here before. They don't live here, bitch. Where do they live? They live in Calabasas. Well, who lives in Topanga? No one lives in Topanga. Someone famous lives in Topanga. I mean, I don't know. Reminding me of like Hawaii with all the winding roads and stuff. We're in PCH. This is my first time here. Okay. Tom Hanks lives here, right? Yeah. Do you remember what I said about Tom Hanks? No, what did you say? I said um he invented that drink. Oh yeah, yeah. You showed me the interview with him. Yeah. yeah. What was the drink called? The a diet cocaine. Diet cocaine. Yeah. Just had this diet coke, and I said, "Oh, give me a shot of champagne in there for crying out loud." In the diet coke. In the diet coke, and everybody said, "Everybody says you're you are insane." Oh, it's pretty out here. It's giving us Laguna Beach vibes. Laguna, yeah. Laguna, Laguna Beach is up here. Let's go back, back to the beginning. That one's a new 7 series, I know that for sure. This one's probably the new 3 series. That one's the new 5 series. Only bad drivers drive me up to you.
or going to um, um, Joshua Tree yeah. or um, Yucca Valley. Yucca Valley. It's Parkway Calabasas, honey. Yes, girls. Where the girls at? Where the girls at? Where the girls at? Where the girls at? Who let the girls out? Where the girls? One of the things I did not get to see when I visited my friend the last time here in LA was the Getty Museum. So my boyfriend made it a point to show it to me and I am so glad he did. Wait, hold on. Ariana, is that you? Yeah. You believe God is a woman. Anyway, it was a great museum and I really felt inspired, recharged, refreshed, and recalibrated to start vlogging again and editing. I've been in a rut lately with my job and the stresses that it comes with as far as being a full-time registered nurse. I needed this vacation and I'm so happy I got to stroll around the Getty Museum for the day. I'm so happy that I found someone who loves art and museums as much as my boyfriend. We have also been to the MoMA and the Met in New York City together as well. Art inspires me, fashion inspires me, music inspires me, nature inspires me, among other things. What inspires you? The tour guide said the Getty started collecting manuscripts in the 1980s because they wanted to cover art from the Middle Ages. They have over 200 manuscripts now. It is so crazy to me how all these things were made so many years ago and how creative people were before modern technology. It is honestly inspiring. It's like basically saying like when we get older like we should be more comfortable with ourselves. Mm -hmm. God's so pretty to oh Lord, bless you. Bless you, Top. Those kids were too much. I hate kids talking or screaming. She's giving, she's giving us Singapore Gardens by the Bay, honey. Spring has sprung, honey. Look at the flowers. The colors. What was your favorite part of the museum so far? Probably this garden. The garden? Yeah. I like the paintings. You do? Yeah, I and like the those sculptures. Too, but these are really pretty. I like more like the paintings of the sculptures versus like modern art, even though I like going to MoMA, you know? Mm -hmm. But this is a really pretty place. There's a lot of people here today because the weather is so nice. It's so aesthetically. What should we do now after this? Is she working yet or is she being worked right now? Instagram husband, influencer, or is she giving or not? Well, she's trying to give. So what are your thoughts on today's museum activities? A lot of fun. That's all? It's a lot of fun. Okay, we should probably go back to our Airbnb and take a nap because you look like you need it. You need it. Because I don't want to be eating dinner with a bitch tonight. You need to. You need a little bit of a nap, bitch. Okay? <laughs> well, shut up. Two hours later. This is Warner Brothers. In the back studio, right, Tom? The back ones. The back ones. The sound stages. It's a lot of fun. Do you feel better? You took a nap now? Yeah. Okay, get me too. Good. So. Mm -hmm. Stay in the middle, two lanes. Stay in the middle, 
too late. All right, guys, we're off to our anniversary dinner, okay? We're off to see the wizard, okay? No, bitch, we're off. <laughs> we're off to our anniversary dinner at Nobu LA, okay? And we passed by Nobu in Malibu today, but we're not eating there. Okay, bye. These palm trees are different. They're taller than the ones in Florida. Mm -hmm. They're older. They're older. What? They don't have, like, a lunch thing, because... When I was looking, which is why it's kind of empty right now. Yeah. We just opened recently. Uh huh. So I don't think they have like a lunch vibe. Here we are at Nobu LA celebrating four years together. Time literally flies. We have our ups and downs like any couple, but I cannot see myself with anyone else. Happy four year anniversary, Top. I love you so much. We started with some edamame. It was funny because my boyfriend said as a joke, he loves edamame and the waitress overheard and started laughing. It was funny, you had to be there. I also got the Toro scallion roll to start with. The new sashimi salmon was fresh and delicious. I would definitely order it again. It was not filling, so I had to get another dish after though. Oh, it was um, sashimi. New sashimi. Mm -hmm. You know my man loves his soup and had to get this mushroom soup tonight. His main entree was the chicken balsamic teriyaki and we both agreed it was five stars. This is the chicken teriyaki, right? Mm-hmm. With the balsamic teriyaki. Oh. Since I was still hungry, I also ordered the tuna tataki, which was once again fresh and the flavors were definitely flavoring. Would definitely order again. Anniversary top. Happy anniversary. Oh my god. This is La La Land, tiny. Oh, that's pretty. There's so many people that live there. All the way to this side? Yeah. Like you were standing next to it? Yeah, me and Lina, we went all the way to the Hollywood sign. We were standing like right there. I have been to the Griffith Observatory last time I was in LA with my friend from nursing school and it definitely was a must-see attraction. Ever since I was a kid, I have always been fascinated with the planets in outer space. My boyfriend told me the Griffith Observatory was first a mansion that a Hollywood starlet owned back in the day, but she ended up getting murdered there. Then the town renovated it and made it what it is today. Yes, I was gullible and believed this false story, but this was a nice ending to our anniversary. Looking up at the stars and looking down at the City of Angels was super romantic, but the night is still young. Live from New York on Saturday night. They, you can see Venus tonight, I guess. He's right there. He's right there. The Mount Wilson. This is the Griffith Oratory, right? What? No, we're the Mount Wilson. Yeah, I know, but we're in the Griffin Observatory. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. late night Target run because I'm an idiot and I forgot my toothbrush. And we need to get some water. Stay hydrated. And poppers. Bitch, you can't <laughs> say that. Thanks for dinner. Thanks for dinner. It's dessert time. I can't believe we're getting dessert. In Burbank. So what are you doing with this? Okay. 
I got coffee lovers only because we're doing it up tonight. What did you get? Cookies, don't you want some? With sweet cream? Yeah. Why didn't you want the French vanilla? I like the sweet cream. Why? I like it. All right. There's nobody here. So eat your ice cream and shop. Okay. Maybe I could have got a like it. No, I couldn't. Because this is too much already, but it's so good. 